Um, I don't know if you are headed towards my direction. I don't know if I should give you a ride. Sorry, have we met? Oh, my bad. My name is Melvin. So, I was headed towards the supermarket to pick up a few items. Then I bumped into a beautiful angel like you. So I decided to say hi. That's very nice. Uh, I sincerely appreciate it. I was thinking if you know me from somewhere. Actually, no. But trust me, it will be such great pleasure to get to know you that if you give me the opportunity or the privilege to drive you. But I'm almost at my destination. Thank you. Great. I love the fact that you use the word almost. Almost isn't at your destination. So, if you permit me, might I join you? towards your destination or might you join me mm. or we might join we <laughs> to <laughs> your destination <laughs> okay that's a yes yeah. fantastic thank you then let me help you with it Thanks very much for the ride. Hey, Thanks come on, come on, you're welcome. Um, is this where you stay or you came visiting? I stay here. Oh, wow. <laughs> Which means we live close to each other then. Oh. Yeah. So I live um, somewhere down the road, Homeland Estates. Okay, yeah. Um, actually, it's nice to meet you. My hmm, pleasure. What should I call this gorgeous lady? <laughs> My name is Nkasi, but friends call me Kasi. Kasi. Cassie. Cassie, Cassie. I like the name. I like the sound of that actually. It sounds so beautiful. Uh, <laughs> my friends say so, but <laughs> I'm used to it. Um, anyway, I am um, running late for my appointment. I don't know, and I would like us to catch up some more, get to know each other. So, if you're kind enough to help me with your contact. Kasi in Kasi? Anyone. Kas Kas Kas. That's so fun. Thank you. Okay, um, I'll see you some other time, okay? Right. Take good care of yourself. Thank you. Yeah.
Welcome. What happened to you? Tisha bless and slapped me. For what? I mean, why would she slap you in the face? Why? I didn't finish my work, so I couldn't submit to another sense of meeting. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry for putting you through this. I rushed to dress a client, okay? okay. I promise this will never happen again. I'm sorry. Your place is actually nice. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, what do I offer you? Oh, don't, don't bother yourself, okay? Actually, I was thinking maybe we should just hang out or something, you understand? And then um, catch some fresh air. How about that? Mm -hmm. That would have been nice, but my daughter will soon be back from school. Your daughter? Yeah. You never told me you have a child. Maybe we've not had a proper introduction. Okay. That's right, actually. So, are you married? No, I'm not married. Was in a relationship, then I got pregnant. He suggested mm -hmm. abortion, which I refused. Then he broke up with me without taking responsibilities. Hey. So sorry about that. Okay? That's so mean of him. Sorry, you see? For what? I mean, my daughter is the best thing that has happened to me. I don't regret having her. That must be Mira. Oh, okay. Yeah, come here, baby. How was school? It was fine. Okay, say hi to my friend. Good afternoon, Uncle. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Okay. You look so beautiful. Thank you. Welcome. So just go inside and take off your uniform. Okay. Go and freshen up. I'll be with you shortly, okay? <sighs> Such a grown baby. Yeah, she's grown. Okay, let me fix something for her to eat. Okay, yes, yeah, sure, sure, sure. guy I told you that gave me a ride last month. Melvin. Oh, the playful guy. Mm -hmm, the playful guy. What about him? He's asking me out. He said he likes me. Wow. He likes you. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. uh, but babe, what do you think? I seriously don't know what to think, Lisa. I don't want to get involved with any more stories of heartbreaks. Well, I like him. He's down to earth. And we vibe together. 
<laughs> I can see you're already attracted to this guy. You like him. I know you. <laughs> but mind you, girlfriend, majority of those acting all playful in the beginning always turns out to be beasts at the end. Okay? So, all I can tell you is that you are an adult. You know what is best for you. Please, be extremely careful. Okay. You're right, Lisa. You know, I've stayed away from relationships ever since I had my daughter. I just mind my business, take care of myself and Mira. And I've got a lot of admirers and relationship proposals, but none interest me. I don't know why I feel this way for him. I like him. I don't know why his case is different. <laughs> what? I can see my friend is in love. <laughs> Anyways, like I said earlier, you are an adult. You know what is good for you. <laughs> I mean, it's not like you would turn him down if I advise you to. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so just follow your mind. But please, be careful. Alright? I'm careful. Good. I'm very careful. I like it. Um, Babe, they are injecting all of us out of the house. I don't know what to do. It's not like I've saved up to the money I need to get a new apartment. That won't be a problem, okay? You have me, like, you can come and stay with us. Mira will be happy to have you. You're joking, right? I'm not joking. I mean, it's just me and Mira in the house. So, you can come and stay with us. Oh my God. <laughs> thank you, my friend. Come here. Oh, okay. thank you. <laughs> so welcome to my house. We are. Oh, please make yourself comfortable. You can sit. Yeah. Uh, hey, bro. What's up? Oh, oh, brother. Yeah, what's up? Yeah. Um, sorry, my bad. Meet Cassie, my darling. Cassie, my brother Henry. So it's okay. Move your hand. Yeah, you can sit and make yourself comfortable. What next you have? Like wine, beer, juice. Just will be fine. Just will be fine. Are you sure? Okay. <laughs> right. Hey, my father, what's up? I'm fine. Okay, no movement today. Yeah, I am here. Is he okay? Who? No, of course it should be. Why? <clears throat> anyway, the juice is here. And so, you said you were going to style a client tomorrow. It's you'll okay. be styling, okay. You said you'll be styling a client tomorrow. Yeah, is that a problem? Um, I should drink it for you. So, you'll trust me. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no problem. So, I was thinking if I should come with you. No way. That's not professional. But not to worry. I won't take the whole day doing that. Hey. I'll be back before you know it. Hey, come on. <laughs> you know I want to feel everything about you. Mm -hmm. I want to be very close to you. Hey. To feel you. Stop. Hey, come on. Are you rejecting my advances? Stop. Are you sure you don't want to? Babe, stop. No, no. Look what you're doing to me. I sincerely appreciate you for letting me in. I promise once I get my apartment ready, I will leave. Come on, Lisa. You don't need to worry about anything. You can stay as long as you want, okay? I mean, what's our friends for if not to cut each other's back? It's just me and Mira in this house, okay? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Honestly, you don't know what you've done for me. God bless you. It's nothing. Besides, Mira will be very happy to have you around. <laughs> I know, right? So. <laughs> Let me quickly fix you something to eat. It's just for today. Just for today. I'm not doing this again. Don't worry. <laughs> After now, we'll be cooking for you. Thank you. Let me fix you something to eat. But it's just for today. No problem. What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh. 
What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh, anything else I feel. Mira, are you okay? Only when I met me to my daddy. Mira, not again. Not now. Where is all this coming from again? See, baby, come. It's just the both of us. Your father never wanted us, and we don't need him, okay? Um, I need him. My friends always tell me how their dad took them out, buy them gifts, and also took them for a vacation during holidays. <sighs> Mira, always learn how to appreciate what you have. I'm trying my possible best to make sure both of us lacks nothing. And please, it would be nice if you forget about him. Go finish your homework, okay? Just go. Mira, are you okay? Intimacy, do you know who my brother is? Yes, I do. Can I take me to my friends? I want to see him. Mira, I'm sorry I can't take you to where your daddy is because I don't know where he is. And I'm not sure your mom knows where he is either. So, just forget about him. Hmm? <laughs> Aunt Elisa, please. Oh, come on, Mira. Enough of this daddy, daddy, daddy thing, okay? See. You know your mom love and care about you a lot. That's all that matters. All right? That's my baby, so Cheryl. So, tell me, what did you... Hey, hey. Oh, <laughs> Hey. <laughs> Mira, how are you? You don't look, you don't look bright. What's, what's happening? Come, come, come. Right here. What's this? You're welcome. <laughs> it seems you like her a lot. Obviously. Thank you. And you know what? Keep being a good girl, okay? Be obedient. Study very hard so that you become one of the best lady in the world. Wow. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> through many things we've gone through many things that turns our heart mommy oh, baby you're back yes mom are you okay mom yes i'm fine it's just this normal stress from work yeah. how was school it was fine are you sure yes hope you didn't look for anybody's trouble yeah. nobody looks for your trouble no Okay, so we just have to go inside and take off your uniform while I fix something for you to eat, okay? Okay. <laughs> Babe, could you believe an old man followed me home today? Cassie. Hello, Cassie, are you okay? <laughs> Babe, talk to me. What's going on? Lisa, I'm speechless. I don't know what came over me. Why? What happened? <sighs> I stopped by Melvin's house when I was coming back from work. We are together, playing, and happy. Shortly, his phone rang. We did call our first love. He muted the call. I asked him to take it. But he said he was going to call back that it wasn't important. I got pissed. I thought he was cheating on me already. Babe, I slapped and pushed him. Before he said it was his mom calling. You did what? I called him a liar and left. Since then I've been trying to call him but his number has been busy. Maybe he has blocked me or something. It's a lie. 
Babe, what is wrong with you? Why can't you just think before you act? Lisa, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. I don't know what to do. Were you drunk? Babe. Cassie, is this what you have become? Hitting a guy, really? What if he had blinded your eye with a punch? Seriously, I'm disappointed at you. Just look for a way and apologize to him. How can you explain that a relationship that is barely three months is becoming toxic already? Babe, I'm seriously in love with Melvin. At this point, I'm becoming so insecure. I don't know. <laughs> no, you are not becoming insecure. You are insecure already. Just, just go apologize to him. That's if he will forgive you because you just made him feel less of a man. Can you just... I don't know what's wrong with you. How can you slap your man? Just... I'm sorry, I don't know what came over me. It will never happen again, please. So what was my offense? Did I commit any crime by loving you? I'm sorry. Bro, it's okay. She has apologized. Just find a way to forgive her. Babe, I'm deeply sorry. I promise it will never happen again, please. Hey, hey, it's fine, it's fine. Just stand up. I don't like that. Just stand, stand. It's fine. Forgive me. Stand, it's fine. Thank Come, you. forgive you. It's fine. Um, we are heading out, so I don't know. You want to join us? Yes. Okay. What are you doing? Come on, go back to the back seat. Go out of the head. Hello, baby. I'm fine, darling. Oh, that would have been nice. But my schedule is really, really tight right now. I understand, I get it. Okay, you know what, baby? Let me call you back shortly. I love you. Who again is bearing all this baby and darling? Who else if not Melvin? Melvin, of course. Melvin? Mm -hmm. I thought you guys are fighting. Not anymore. We made up. Wow. Really? Yes. I was about telling you how I went to his place to tender my apologies. Babes. Henry was my saving grace. You know what? Henry pleaded on my behalf. And he accepted and forgive me. <laughs> wow. Um, Melvin is really a nice guy. Wow. <laughs> I'm happy you guys made up. Mm -hmm. um, Cassie. Uh, listen, okay? I'm not trying to tell you how to live your life. But I think you should slow down and learn anger management. See, babe, this issue of you hitting a guy first will do you more harm than good. Lisa, let's not go through this route again, please. I accepted the fact that I was wrong and I apologized. Must you always make me look like a bad person? It's okay, I'm sorry. But I've said my own. And I've heard you. Thank you. 
It's okay, we're not quarreling, right? Don't worry, okay? She'll be fine. Her temperature is high. And her breath. Yeah, don't, don't worry, she's gonna be fine. I understand that um, she's running temperature. But like the doctor said, and after administering the, the proper medication to calm down her running temperature, everything would be fine. She will be fine. Babe, I'm worried. I'm just worried. I just hope she gets better. She will get better. Okay? You don't have to worry. Okay. You're fine, okay? Is she eating? Is she eating? Yeah. At least that's a good sign. Okay, are you going anywhere today? Um, no. Just walk stuff. Alright, I have an appointment to catch up with. Can I okay. borrow your car? Um, okay, yes, fine. Since I'll be walking from home. Yeah, you can have it. Thank you. But just drive safe. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Just drive safe. Sure. Welcome, ma. Fide, how are you? I'm fine, ma. Welcome. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm fine. Perry, thank you very, very much for the other day. Thank you for interceding on my behalf. It's okay. I really appreciate it. It's okay. It's okay, but I want you to know that Melvin loves you so much. So be careful. Don't take advantage of the love, okay? I do that. Was it intentional? Fine. Thank I need you. to. I have an appointment to catch up with, so I need to start going. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things that turns our hearts. We've been through many things. What did she going to say about this stuff? Um, yeah. Hey. Hey. Babe, I, I thought you said you were taking Mira to Abuja to meet with your aunt. Yes, baby, but I'm back. If I recall correctly, you said you were spending babe, one week. Babe, I know what I said, but I am back. Don't you miss me or something? Hey, come on, babe. Why are you going to say something like that? Of course, I, I miss you. At least you should have told me. Are you sure? You should have told me that you were coming home when we spoke this morning. I wanted to surprise you because I missed you so much. I want to be with you. Oh, I come here. Mm. I miss you, man. <laughs> so what are you doing? Um, babe, walk. That's a song, babe. I'm sure you won't understand that. Babe? Baby? Oh, babe? Good morning, very late for work, but my customer is really waiting for me. No breakfast? Hey, babe, no breakfast. No breakfast, baby. Just, just get something to eat and sleep. I, I'll make you something for you. Yeah. I'm still very sleepy. Okay. Okay. Don't very late, I'll be Okay. Okay, now talk to you later, okay? Flag. 
It is what it is. Okay. You know what today is so all. Look forward to better tomorrow. What have you been up to today? We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. Oh, oh, oh. But peace of mind. Yes, how are you doing? Did you make anything today? What? Kasi, what's this now? And why is everywhere scattered? Breadcrumbs everywhere. Look at my cushion chair. What, 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 what's going on? I was going to fix it. I was, I was actually on the phone before you came back. You were going to fix it, fix it. And you were outside with a glass of juice where you had breadcrumbs everywhere, a cup you used in having your tea. And c -c -c come on, explain Enough this. already. Enough of all this. I said I was going to tidy it. I was going to fix it. And you are going to fix it. And Please. you left this and you were outside with a glass it. of juice. And I asked you if you made anything, but you refused to speak up. What? And I'm talking to you. What? I told you I was going to fix it, but yet you keep getting. Yet... No, 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 no. What's wrong with you? Look at the entire house. Everywhere is messy, and and, and, and and you want me? To, you want me to applaud you for it? You can go ahead and clap for all I care. You should have gotten yourself a help since you need someone to clean the I house. I should have gotten myself. Yes, a help. I'm your girlfriend. Look, 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 I'm your girlfriend. I'm not. I'm not your housemaid. Melvin, I'm not your housemaid. I'm tired of your numerous complaints. I'm tired already. Yes, you are you complaining so much. Take a look at the room. Take That's a look at the not my business. Employ someone, not me. Excuse you. What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh. What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh. Anything aside, peace. It's a red flag. Anything aside, peace. Oh, it's a red flag. Oh. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things that turns our heart. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. Oh. Hey, babe, are you okay? I'm telling you, Bruce. I've been trying to stop a car, but no one is stopping. Uh, oh my God, where, where are you heading? Jibola Street. Would you mind if I drop you off? What is my pick you? Body hurt can take, should be peace and nothing. Are you taking any medication yet? No, I am not. Would you mind if we go to any pharmacy around? Okay. It's a red flag. Anything aside, please. Oh, it's a red flag. Thank you so much for your kind gesture. I sincerely appreciate this and won't forget it in a hurry. It's heart. okay. It's okay. Just try and take your drugs, okay? I will. Can I at least know your name? Oh, my name is Henry. Okay, I I'm Lisa. Okay. Uh, oh, please, Lisa, can you can you give me your contact so I can check up sure. on you and know okay. how you're doing? Zero nine one triple two. I'll give you a call, okay? No problem. Just take, take care you. of yourself. Yeah. Thank you once again. All right, bye. bye.
So excited. I thought you said you are sick. Sit down. Oh, oh babe. Mm -hmm. Two days ago was hell for me. Okay. I was at work when my body system changed. And before you knew it, I started shivering. Ah, long story cut short. A guy gave me a ride. On our way, we stopped by the pharmacy. He got me some drugs. And since then, we've been talking like we're just good friends. <laughs> oh my god, man. he's so down to hurt. Look at you, you're already falling in love when he's not even ask you out. Go away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anyways, I'm happy you are happy. I don't even need to ask you how you are feeling because you're obviously better. Oh, I'm totally fine. <laughs> Anyways, I came to pick up something, but I will rest a little before going back. Uh, babe, wait. You are this your maybe guy. Well, don't tell us about our wife like me. <laughs> Babe, love is a beautiful thing. You okay. just have to experience it, okay? <laughs> no doubt. Alright, I will join you oh, soon, eh? Back to your call. Sure. <laughs> yeah, babe. I'm sorry about that. My friend just walked in. <laughs> so, as we say, mm-hmm. Hey, Yeri, what's up? I didn't see you last night. Uh, yeah, I was just sitting out with friends. Oh, okay. So, but what are you doing? You, uh, Cassie should be the one doing that since she's here. Why are you cleaning? Hey, come on. Anybody can do the cleaning. Yes. Doesn't really matter. You two, you can clean. Bro, I don't want to intrude in your relationship, but do you think Cassie is the right person for you? Henry, Cassie is the right person for you. Yeah, and there's no changing that. I don't know what your reasons are saying this, but whatever be your reasons, I love Cassie. End of case. And the question is, does she love you as much as you love her? There are red flags. I hope you're seeing them. Hope you're seeing them, bro. It doesn't really matter. Anybody can clean the house. Come on. Yes, this is my house. So I can clean the house. Harry too can clean the house. Cassie can clean the house. Come on, I'm a young man. You understand? Sweet 20. We've been <laughs> through many things. We've gone through many things. That turns our hearts. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. Oh. But peace of mind, you need peace of mind. You're you are the one who is unbelievable. You are not just unbelievable, but you are foolish at the same time. 
You took me out there to meet one of your numerous girlfriends. And you're here telling me she's your cousin? Shame on you, Melvin. Shame on you, Leia. What do you have to tell me? Disappointed. I am also disappointed. I am disappointed already. You to meet my numerous girlfriends. That's what you did. That was my cousin. That I haven't seen for so many years. And I decided to walk up to her to say hello to catch up on old times. And you put up an attitude. Not only were you disrespectful, but you walked out. I should give you a rest. Please listen to me when I talk. When in actual fact, I was trying to take what we share to the next level by proposing to you. Obviously, it's bad luck because the case is even broken. Don't come near me. Don't, don't, don't even come close. You know what? To hell with you. To hell with your character. To hell with your. Come on, get off me. Come. Come in. Come in. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh. You're welcome. Thank you. Your house is fine. Thank you. Please make yourself comfortable. Sit. Who is she to you? Oh, that's Cassie, my friend. You know, I told you I had an apartment issue, so. She accommodated me. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, she's my brother's girlfriend. You don't mean it. Yeah. So you are the Henry she told me about. <laughs> wow, what a coincidence. Yes, <laughs> of course. Hey, it's all right. Yes. Sit down. Yeah, that will be fine. Oh, there is you. Do you have any baby around here? Yes, she has a child. Didn't your brother tell you she has a child? No. Wow. Is the baby here? Is she around? No. She went to Abuja to spend a holiday with the aunt. Uh, many shockers. It's okay, enough of that. So, what should I offer you? Anything. Anything? Water. 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 Children. All right, no problem. Have chilled water. <laughs> don't know what your problem is. Why do you keep ruining things for yourself, Cassie? Why is it always you, you, you? Just, just look at how you've ruined everything. Lisa, I'm trying so hard to be me again. I'm really trying, but it's not working. You know how submissive I used to be? You know, and it doesn't make me a good girl. I don't care who my man goes out with and who he talks to. But he called me a weakening that I wasn't able to protect what I said was mine. <sighs> Babe, please. I've told you before, being overprotective and insecure won't and cannot keep a man. Instead, it scares him away and make you toxic. I am not saying you should be nonchalant, but babes, too much of everything is bad. 
Don't just look at how you're treating a man who really wants to be with you, all because of someone who just came to play games with you. Please, help me beg him. That's what I'm asking of you. Help me and talk to him. I'm pregnant. You're what? Yes. Oh my god. Cassie, what have you done? I don't know how to talk to him. He has refused to talk to me ever since. I've been apologizing yet. He doesn't want to talk to me. That's because he's fed up. Obviously, he's tired. Please, just help me and talk to him. I believe he will hear you out, okay? Please. Nobody hurt can take Should be peace and nothing more <sighs> Hey, bro. Hey, hi, what's up? Okay. Yeah, heading out. Yes, I I actually wanted to see the barista. Concerning that property. Oh, okay, nice. You remember that Lisa girl? Yeah, she's a nice lady. What about her? I think um I'm beginning to fall in love with her. I have taken my time to study her and she's perfect. Wow. That's great. So the other time I visited her, I saw a portrait of Cassie. I asked her, she said Cassie is her friend. What a coincidence then. Um, no way, she's friends. If they're friends, actually, I know that Cassie is a nice lady. Yeah. I also saw a baby's shoe and I asked. She said the shoe belongs to Cassie's daughter. Are you aware she has a daughter? Yes, I am aware and Mira is a name actually. And I love her so much because she is super smart. Bro, I think you are making a very big mistake. Really? Yes. I mean, this lady in question, she's a single mother. She doesn't have good attitude. She, ha she has bad attitude. So you become a judge of character. For the fact that she's a single mother doesn't make her less of a human being. And yes, I love her for the fact that she's a single mother and a superwoman. So what do you call her nagging nature? Someone who complains about everything. I worry too much. I love Cassie like that. And I am certain she will change. She will change? Yes. And she keeps getting worse. Can you tell me when was the last time you had innermost peace, brother? Anyway, good luck. See you later. Melvin, please. She's really, really sorry. And she's ready to change. Please. This is not a real character. I'm sorry. Please give her another chance. I think you should ask your friend what she really wants. I love her, yes, but this whole shit is really, the whole toxic shit is really scary. Mervyn, Cassie loves you for real. Like I told you, this is not her character. You see, the father of her daughter made her believe being an understanding and calm partner isn't healthy. She caught him cheating severally without fighting anyone, yet she was abandoned with her daughter's pregnancy. She's only trying to protect you from other women out there. Please try it. fighting me publicly? Embarrassing me all the time? It's a it isn't nagging? First off, I am not a baby daddy. Second, I haven't given her any reason to question my love for her. So, why is she eating up herself and trying to frustrate the hell out of me? I understand how you feel. Well, you don't. I do. Please, I'm begging you. Forgive her for the sake of the love you both shared. Please. <sighs> Melvin, Cassie is pregnant. For who? For you. 
You're joking, right? I'm not joking, Melvin. She told me and she even showed me the results. I'm serious. I... She's only scared that you mm -hmm. might abandon her just like the other man did. <sighs> no, no, come on. I I won't abandon her, okay? I, I actually want Cassie for keeps. Like, I love her, bro. I... Okay, no problem. I, I, I've heard you. I, I'll try and reach out to her, okay? Yes. Oh, yeah, I really appreciate that. No, 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 no problem. Thank you. Okay. Um, all right. I'll be on my way now. Oh, I'm so sorry that I, Rena, I did not offer you anything. And it's okay. It's too late, though. It's okay. I was just moody. No problem. Take care. <laughs> but it's also too late, I can't see you. <laughs> don't worry, I'm good. Okay. <sighs> She's so very nice for what the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh. What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. Ooh. Yes, who's there? Who is there coming? The door is open. <laughs> Baby. Baby. Yeah. Baby, I'm, I'm sorry. Hey, just stop, stop. Okay? I forgive you. I mean it. I forgive you. Look me in my eyes. I know you've been through a lot. My words still remain. I know you've been through so much disappointment. But I just want you to know that. I love you and I want to love you unconditionally. I love you, baby. You're everything I want. So just allow me to treat you like a proper woman. Like the way you deserve to be treated. Which is why I am doing this. Babe. Yeah. <laughs> be, be the mother to my unborn children. Please, marry me. Yes, baby, I'll marry you. You will? Yes, baby. You will. Thank you so much, Come. Thank you. I love you so much. I love you so much. It's just that the joy I feel inside of me is unimaginable. Mm -hmm. And I can't wait to meet my bundle of joy. Because <laughs> I know it. it's a baby boy. What if he's a baby girl? It's a baby boy, come on. <laughs> okay. I love you. I love you too, baby. Mm. But you need to go back to sleep. Ah, oh, I just want to stay awake and watch you all night. You know, you told me your baby's out to work tomorrow. Yeah. And I go back to sleep so that you have enough rest. Mm. Yeah, call me. Love you, baby. I love you too. Have you come and sleep on my chest? <laughs> Good 
Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Who are you? My name is Doris. I'm looking for yoga. The owner of this house. Sida, who is here? Ma, she said that her name is Doris and she's looking for the owner of the house. Doris? I don't know any Doris. My name is Doris. I'm looking for Mr. Melvin. Mr. Melvin, that's my husband. What business do you have with him? Actually, I've been trying to get him over the phone, but he's not picking Can up. Can you go straight to the point and tell me why you are looking for my husband? The thing is that Melvin and I had a thing in the past, and I got pregnant. You are joking, right? I'm serious, mother. You are serious? How dare you walk into my compound to, to tell me you are pregnant for my husband? But I'm really pregnant! I'm not saying like this. Doris was here. She said you got her pregnant. Now, babe. Hey, babe, come on. I, I, I don't know any Doris at all. You don't know who Doris is? Hey, 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 Oh, okay, I swear I don't know any swear Doris. Swear you don't know your brother got another woman pregnant. Jesse, calm down, okay? I, I don't know any Doris. So, so, just chill. Leave, 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 leave. Stay away from me. What did I do to you? Why? How could you do this? Okay, 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 I can explain. Uh, Cassie, Cassie, oh. Please, please, please. Just leave me alone. I want you to talk. What did you do? I don't know. I'm confused. I'm confused. I, 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 don't, I don't know why. I have not had anything with any other woman since Cassie came into my life, and I'm telling you the gospel. Cassie, I still think you should hear him out. There must be a mix up somewhere. What mix up are you talking about? Mixed up that he doesn't sleep with the lady or he doesn't know her at all. I don't believe that lady made up that story. I don't believe that. With how Henry attests of Mervyn's love for you, I don't think he can do that. Okay, fine. Cassie is stupid. Cassie is mad. Nobody wants to hear me out. Nobody wants to believe me. Melvin is innocent. Don't hurt yourself. Can you just calm down? Take it easy on yourself. Lisa, if you are in my shoes, you would do more. Cass Cassie! We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. That turns our hearts. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. Oh, oh, oh. But peace of mind. You need peace of mind. You need peace of mind to be happy. You heal for yourself. I'm sorry. See me like a devil. But at least can you hear me out? What he heard can take should be peace and nothing more. I I don't know what I have done that you don't despise me like I mean nothing to you. I love you. And I can't possibly do anything to hurt you. Not now or ever. If if not for anything, please just hear me out. Please, please, please. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things. That taunts our hearts. 
How could you guy? How could you? You didn't even use protection. What if she, she infected you? Brother, you know the type of lady that is in your life. Yet you are so careless. And here I am defending you all along. I don't know, Henry. I, I was drunk that night. I know. I'm not surprised anyway. I'm not surprised. This is what you go about doing. Numerous people chatting you, telling you how much they love you, and you are even responding. You tell me you love me. What do you think you are doing? Okay, let's see. You are responding. I, uh, Melvin, what, what are you doing? Okay, you go ahead and marry everybody. Go ahead and propose to everybody. Go ahead and give everybody engagement ring. I don't blame you. morning I saw her next to me which means we had a thing. I warned you about this. I warned you but you didn't listen. The, the red flags were there from the onset. Yet you didn't listen. You didn't think about that. Now look at your life. Just look at you. I didn't know when I gave her information about myself and to add that I paid her off. So tell me why is she doing this? Why? Why is she doing this? I think she's in a situation she can't handle alone. Yes. All the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. What the heart can take should be peace and nothing more. I don't know, Lisa, I don't know. Okay, but at least can you help me talk to her to listen to what I have to say about what happened that night? I only left the house that night just to calm my head down from the numerous knocks without knowing I was going to land myself into a more serious mess. I'm short of words. I still really do not understand how Cassie changed overnight. <laughs> he won't believe she's even mad at me. <laughs> yeah, just because I was actually thinking maybe someone just made up a story to cause problems for the both of you. I never knew it could be real. Yeah, to, to be honest with you, I don't know. It wasn't intentional. <sighs> As I speak to you right now, I am even scared of going back to the house. She knows she sees me as a demon. Come on. You don't have to be scared. I promise you will come around. Hmm? Don't worry, I'll talk to her. Just put yourself together, okay? Everything will be alright. Alright? I hope so. Hey, babes. Hey, Lisa. I'm fine. Please, I need you to help me pick Mira from the airport by 4 p.m. I thought you said she was going to remain with your sister. Well, I changed my mind. Can you do that for me? It's okay. 4 p.m. then. Okay, thank you. All right. Bye. Bye. Oh, my baby. 
everybody, I miss you. Good to see you. Look at how big you are. Come here, come here, come here. I miss you. My baby is grown. Yes, you ask so many questions at a time. Yes, I now have a daddy. <laughs> come, come, let me show you to your room, okay? <laughs> Anything. Should have served yourself a drink. No, I'm, I'm fine. I don't feel like taking anything. Okay. You say so. Cassie, please. I want you to sort things out with your husband. Both of you can't be living like enemies under the same roof. Just calm your mind and sort things out with him before you lose him to other women out there. Melvin got another woman pregnant. Lisa, what is left for me? A lot is left, Cassie. A lot. Please, sort things out before you lose your man. You're gradually losing him. Everyone is coming to advise me. Cassie is the bad person here. And Melvin is the good one. And none of you advise him not to flex. Can you just bring down your voice? Consider your condition, please. Melvin is not a flirt. According to him, you guys had a fight and he left the house to cool off his, his head. In the process, he got drunk and shit happened. He's a man. Really? He's a man. It's obvious he paid you to come and say all this to me. It's very obvious. What? Oh. Just the same way you paid me to beg him to forgive you your mess, right? Excuse me. I can go for all my care. I am the bad person. I've missed you so much. Oh, why didn't you tell me you were coming back today? I, I wanted to take you on our ways. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And what if I wasn't home? Yeah, we talked. And you told me you would be home all day. <laughs> yeah. Welcome, darling. Mm -hmm. um, I actually went to pick Mira up from the airport, but I returned as soon as possible. Mira? Who is she? Cassie's child. Oh, okay. Okay, so what do you care for? Rice, your favorite? No, you. My hey. favorite. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Come <laughs> here. How have you been? Look at you. You've grown. <laughs> You've added so much flesh. My mom told me I came to be my daddy. Oh, she said that? Yes. She also told me I'm going to be having a brother soon. She said all of that to you? Yes. And actually, what she said is the truth. And I am sure you're going to make an amazing big sister. <laughs> my love. How are you? Is she 
Okay. <laughs> yes, actually, she's okay. You know, your baby brother sometimes he just also stress your mom, but she'll be fine. It's just one of those pregnancy symptoms. We've been through many things, we've gone through many things that turns our hearts. We've been through many things. We've gone through many things oh, oh, oh. But peace of mind You need peace of mind You need peace of mind to be happy Please, can we talk? Please, can we talk? Don't you ever! Don't you dare touch me again. Do you understand me? Don't try it. Fine. I have heard you. No, 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 no problem. Go ahead and do whatever it is you want. I have tried. I have tried trying to prove myself to you. I am tired. I am tired of everything. I am tired of your numerous snacks. I am tired of your temperament issues. I am tired of everything that you do in this house. All I needed was a wife and not someone to drive me insane. All of this was your fault. And yes, I, I, I got someone pregnant. Yes. Because, because if not because of you, I wouldn't have left the house that night. And all of this would have been avoided. But you caused it all. And guess what? I will leave this house for you. And you will never ever set your eyes on me again. Did you listen to yourself? Oh, go on. Go to anywhere you like. I don't care. I don't care, Melvin. You can go to anywhere you like. I don't care. Go on. Go and sleep with other ladies. Get them pregnant. I cost it. I pushed you. You regret this. You will be the one to regret it, not me. Who are you? Hey, 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 stop. Hey, 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 Roberta. Roberta. I can't see what I'm looking for. I don't want to, I, I see you're out to frustrate me, right? So what are you looking for here? Maybe, <laughs> please, I have no real to go. And I don't care if you have any place to stay or not. I want to get up. Don't, 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 don't touch me. Please, I'm very, I don't want to see you around this premises anymore. Are you hearing me? I don't want to see you here again. So you get up. Hey, That's my bad. Leave this place. Leave this place. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I don't want to know it. Maybe, please. Maybe, please. I'll be telling you. I don't have any girl to go down for you from I am pregnant for you from Kaya Love. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe please. <laughs> Maybe please. <laughs> Hello, Harry. Harry, please, have you seen Melvin? I haven't seen him and his phone has been off. I haven't seen him in four days and his numbers has been off. How do you mean? He left home since four days and I can't reach him. I've been trying to reach him but I can't. Listen, listen, let me warn you. If anything happens to Melvin, I don't have to discuss this over the phone. Oh, hello? Harry, are you there? What have I done? What have I done? Hi. Please come back to me.
anything happens to my brother, if anything happens to Melvin, I will make your life miserable. What is wrong with you? Why are you so wicked and hard-hearted? I warned my brother about you. I warned him to stay away from you, but he ignored all the red flags and chose to bring you in. Yet, you, you, you brought him pain. You brought him pain. You didn't want him to have peace. I don't even know what my brother saw in his stupid, heartless, senseless, wicked, single mother like you. Don't you dare judge me with my past. How dare, how dare you? Listen, listen, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm not Melvin. If you try this again, I'll, I'll strangle you. I know you know where he is, please. Just tell him to come back home. Lisa, please. How do you mean? What are you talking about? Melvin and Greeley left the house. Till now he has not come home, please. And his numbers have been off. I went to his place of work. But they say he's not been there. Please help me. Cassie, you deserve an award. I'm sure you're happy. You're certainly happy because you have succeeded in frustrating him. Only God knows when. I begged you. Cassie, I begged you severally to let go, yet you stood your ground. Just, just look at how you frustrated a man who genuinely loves you, all because of what was stupid idiot did to you. Lisa, please. Cassie, please. just pray nothing happens to Melvin. Please. Pray. Lisa, please, don't leave me. Please, please, Lisa, don't leave me. Just, you are the only person I can talk to right now, and you are the only person that can help me, please. Just follow me to the station, let's go and make a report. Please. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you Lisa, this time. Please. Because I am not going through this with you. You are in this alone. I want you, didn't I? Let Lisa. go of me. Hey. Lisa, please. Lisa. Please come back to me. I'm sorry for all I've put you through. Please forgive me. My name is Daddy coming back. My way is Daddy. Mira, leave me alone. Just go away. Go to your room. Leave me. Good evening, ma. Young lady, what do you want? What do you really want? Ma, please. I don't have anywhere to go to. The bar which I was staying after I got pregnant, my mother chased me out of the bar. Please let me stay here. Even if it's to be your house help, I don't mind. You want to be my house help when you're already pregnant for my husband? <laughs> Listen, I'm offering you five million naira to leave us alone. You've done enough already. The money will be enough for you to rent an apartment, have your baby, and start up something for yourself. I haven't seen my husband in a week. I can't even reach him. You've done enough. Just leave us alone. You're rejecting the offer? That's your business. Come, come, let Melvin marry you. It's still over a week, and I've not heard from Melvin. No news whatsoever of his whereabouts. His lines are switched off. There is no information from him. The police has no information about his whereabouts. I'm worried sick. 
I've checked almost all the hospitals in this vicinity and they don't have any record of any accident victims. What's going on? Where could he be then? Maybe he traveled out of the country to cool off from the stress Cassie has put him through. I warned my brother about that girl. I, I told her to leave that toxic relationship, but, but he didn't listen to me. Uh, he ignored all the red flags. Now, see what is going on. See what's happening to him. Uh, babe, come on. You've blamed him enough. And I think that is why he never told you of his whereabouts. And that's his business, not mine. <laughs> oh, now it's your business. Because we are talking about a brother and you're worried. Okay. Oh, your phone? It's Melvin. It's Melvin. Hello? Hello, bro, Alpha? Yeah, good, good. Better well, meet me at our usual spot, okay? Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. You'll see me there in, in ADV. Oh, great, great. Okay. Where is he? He said he's in a bar. He told me the bar. Okay. Uh, we need to go there immediately. Uh, okay, babe, I'm coming with you. All right. The stress I've put you through, please. I'm sorry. Please, I'm sorry. Just sit. Please. Sit in there. Sorry. I'm here now, okay? I'm not leaving. It's not leaving you. I am not leaving, okay? Please. I promise I'll never put you through this again. Hey, it's, it's fine, okay? It's fine. The most important thing is that I love you. That's what matters, okay? Yeah, I love you. And um, I take full responsibility for everything. It's actually my fault. No, it's not your fault. It's mine. I was trying to protect what is mine. Little did I know I was ruining my marriage. Hey, it's fine, okay? Okay, okay come here. Come here, I'll give you. Okay. of mine. 